right, so welcome to my first YouTube video I will be uploading on my channel. And I really, really hope you want to have a little nosy and insight about my life and kind of what I am getting up to. So I am Katie Henderson. I am 20 years old and I live in Scotland. The coldest place on earth, I feel like. Anyway, I am just going to answer some questions um, so you can get to know me just a little bit better. So here we go. What is your middle name? My middle name is Louise. What is your favorite subject in high school? Mine was definitely art. I love art. Only thing I was really good at. What is your favorite drink? That has to be fizz. I absolutely love fizz sticks and you will learn a lot about fizz sticks on my channel. Just the best. It's a replacement for coffee because I was a coffee obsession. Obsession? Um, I had a coffee obsession, but now this has totally taken its turn. What is your favorite song at the moment? My favorite song would probably be Hold On by Justin Bieber. I don't know. I don't really listen to Do you have children? No. And I don't really want any for a while. <laughs> I'd like to be in my, my late 20s before I have kids. Right now, I'm just focusing on myself. Have you participated in any sports? Yes, I was in netball and I was in horse riding and I loved all of them. The only kind of sports I did, well, net, netball wasn't really, I was in a, I was in it for like two or three weeks and that was, that was, a, that was a burden. What is your favorite color? My favorite color is purple, cream and white really random that purple doesn't go with cream or white but maybe white but what is your favorite perfume for sure olympia paco raban that is my go-to i fell in love with it my friend let me try it once and i just have not like been able to bypass it with anything do else. you speak any different languages nope <laughs> i don't know how to speak in different languages um i used to go to a spanish school but, and we got like a private, me and my brother got like a private tutor that would help us because when we moved over there, my mum was like, so yeah, you're going to uh, an English speaking Spanish school. I was like, okay, that's fine. That's cool. Got there. No one knew a word of English. I was like, great. So we had to learn. Still, still don't know though. It's only for a year. I mean, we were 12 years old, so it's been a bit of a while now. What is your favorite holiday? My favorite holiday definitely has to be Dubai. It is the best place on earth. I feel like I love it so, so much. I spent Christmas there with my, uh, with my sister because she lives out there and I loved it. It was just different lifestyle. I mean, we ordered a, we ordered, we ordered a turkey in because she can't cook, which really kind of <laughs> hit a bit hard for me because you just, I personally feel like your Christmas dinner should be cooked at home. But it was nice, it was nice, just wasn't the same, but it is my favorite place. What is your favorite animal? My favorite animal was a dog and I do love dogs. I love dogs, like I am obsessed with dogs, but what just strikes a bit harder is my cat. <laughs> I don't know why and like, um, I love my cat so, so much and he has changed the like how I felt because you can see him, he's just with this little head collar on. He just got neutered, so I can't really take it off. So he's got 10 days with the goodness on his head, the lampshade. Of all animals, really, and horses, love horses. Do you have any siblings? Yes, I have a brother who is 22, and I have two older sisters and two half sisters, but they don't live at home. They're all moved out and away in different countries so it's really sad I don't get to see them as well did you like school I loved school I honestly loved school so much and I I would tell it I would tell myself when I was in school like if I could go back to school just just stick it like these are the easy times there's no jobs well you can still have a job in school but there's no like worry like you just need to go to school and you have a bit more fun and honestly I would tell myself to maybe concentrate a bit more but you gotta have fun with it, I guess. PC or Mac? PC? No, no, Mac, Mac. <laughs> 100% a Mac, I can't deal with a PC. PC stresses me, like, honestly stresses me out. What phone do you have? I have an iPhone. I love iPhones. I used to be Samsung until I smashed my Samsung on the, stair on the stairs once and I was really upset. How tall are you? I am five foot three-ish, four. I feel like I'm growing though. 
someone said that to me they're like oh you're definitely you're taller than that I'm like, i don't think so <laughs> i don't want to, i don't know do you have any pets yes i have a cat <laughs> what are some of your favorite youtubers oh that's quite a tricky one i have quite a few i used to be obsessed with like zoella and everyone but i do like the side men a lot <laughs> i have a wee little thing where i just come home from work and i just pop them on the tv like the side men um but hair and makeup sometimes just to get some advice have you been out of the country? Yes, um, from the age of five, I have traveled um, abroad, stayed in a few countries just because of my dad had worked um, in a company where he had to travel a lot. So we got a really good life and met some amazing people and loved it, really, really loved it. Kind of took it for granted now that I've realized I'm back home. So always be grateful for what you have in the moment because you don't know what, like, you don't know how it feels when it's not there. Um, most exciting thing I have ever done. Oh, I would 100% say the best thing I have done so far was be a body double for an actress. And I have never, I had never done it before, but it was the best experience of my life. And I am very grateful to continue to be her full-time body double when I am needed. It was amazing. I've seen things I've never seen before and I've done extra work and watching um, in the background of how like movies have been made and how I absolutely love it. Best thing ever. But I don't know if I can tell you who it is because I don't know. So that is a little bit about me. I know I could probably answer a bit more because you do tend to get carried away, but we'll leave it there and I will come back and speak to you again. Thank you for listening and hopefully you got to know a bit more about me. Maybe not everything and um, the most interesting things but I picked a few <laughs> just to try <laughs> so I hope you have a lovely day and I will see you next time bye